वेलकम टू द विंडोज क्लब इफ यू एनकाउंटर द एर कोड जीरो एक्स ए जीरो जीरो एफ फोर टू फाइव जीरो विद द एर कोड फोटो कैप्चर फेल्ड देन आई दी थ्रू दिस आर्टिकल ऑन द वेबसाइट और सिंपली वॉच दिस वीडियो आई विल गाइड यू टू द रेजोल्यूशन द फर्स्ट सोल्यूशन इज टू अपडेट द कैमरा ऐप ओपन द माइक्रोसॉफ्ट स्टोर गो टू लाइब्रेरी हियर देन क्लिक ऑन गेट अपडेट्स इट विल ऑटोमेटिकली स्टार्ट अपडेटिंग ऑल द एप्लीकेशन इंक्लूडिंग द कैमरा ऐप द नेक्स्ट सोल्यूशन इज टू अन इंस्टॉल एंड री इंस्टॉल द कैमरा एप्लीकेशन टू डू सो सर्च फॉर पावर शेल इन द विंडो सर्च बार and click on run as administrator in the right pane to open the elevated powershell window now first of all you'll have to copy the first command and paste it here this will remove the camera application after this copy the second command and paste it here this will reinstall the camera application to your computer the third solution will be to update the camera driver to update any driver right click on the start button and select settings from the menu go to the windows update tab on the list on the left hand side in the right pane click on advanced options select optional updates if any update is present then please install the same then go back to the windows update tab and click on check for updates once again the next solution is to close background programs using the camera application search for task manager in the window search bar and open the task manager application now all the processes will be displayed here check which process uses the camera application for example in some cases this web view gpu process could be using it or for some the browser itself can be using it or skype could be using it simply right click on it and select end task the next solution will be to repair or reset the camera app right click on the start button and select settings from the menu in the settings menu go to the apps tab on the list on the left hand side in the right pane click on installed apps wait for a few seconds for this to load corresponding to the camera application click on the three dots and select advanced options now scroll down to the reset section and then click on repair first and after that you can reset the application The next solution will be to turn off any antivirus on your system. If you do not have an antivirus, you will definitely have Windows security. So, search for Windows security in the Windows search bar and open the application. Go to virus and threat protection. Go to manage settings and disable the switch for real time protection. If it asks for a user prompt, then please click on yes. The last solution is to troubleshoot in the clean boot state. Press the window key and the R button together to open the run window. In the run window, type the command msconfig and hit enter. This will open the system configuration window. Go to the services tab. Check the box associated with hide all Microsoft services. If any other services checked, please click on disable all. Finally, click on apply and then on OK to save the settings and then restart your computer. It will reboot in the clean boot state. After that you can troubleshoot using the hit and trial method isn't this easy and interesting if you have any doubts please go to the original article on the website scroll down to the comment section and write your query we will surely answer to it do not forget to subscribe to the channel thank you for watching this video and have a nice day